This is a very, very cool vintage machine. It's a new home Janome model 671. It is light turquoise in color, very, very retro. Um, the cool thing is the spool pins on the back that kind of lay backwards instead of straight up. Very, very neat. It's turquoise and white two tone. It's a straight zigzag machine. It does have a cam here under this cover. And the zigzag cam is included. Now, I've had this machine for like two weeks. I've been searching on eBay. I bought a set of cams, thought they were the right cams for this machine. They are not. So, I've given up the fight for now, and I'm selling it without the cams. Just the zigzag cam is included, which, of course, is the most important one. But, um, you just have to be on the lookout for cams. And also, I do not have the manual to include with it, but I will provide the link for download. I did find it on my favorite sewing machine manual site, and I will provide that link. Very, very clean machine. Hardly a scratch, nick, or mark on it. Very shiny. As you can see, it, the paint's beautiful. No major paint scratches, paint dings, paint while loss, or anything. Um, this is your stitch length. This is your stitch width. And it also has adjustable needle position right center and left. Feed dog drop here. It is a low shank machine standard low shank feet and attachments will work. 15 by 1 needles and of course class 15 bobbins. At this time I do not have any accessories to include. Uh, zigzag foot is included. I've got a whole drawer full of feet here and nothing spectacular. It, it, you know I have high shank, I have slant shank, I have Kenmore super high shank. There's a high shank zipper foot. I have necky feet. It's frustrating. But a few bobbins will be included as well as the zigzag foot that you see. And the standard low shank feet are easy to find. Now, let's sew with her for a little bit. She's tabletop ready. She's just serviced or she will install into any Singer cabinet or carrying case. She shares the same deck dimensions with the Singer. Singer cabinets are going to be your easiest to find in like your local thrift shops or Craigslist or something like that. They're going to be the easiest to find and they will work just fine with this lady. Now might I point out that I believe that you can easily do creative embroidery with this machine. Oh yeah. Creative embroidery, let's bring in our length a little. Widen out, go back, widen out, narrow, widen out, narrow, widen out. It's easy to do creative embroidery. Nice, steady zigzag. And it is all metal, by the way. Very nice stitch. Looky there. Perfect. Oh, could have tweaked in the tension just a hair more. All metal, but lightweight. Very neat. Denim. Five layers of denim using a size 16 needle. Nice. Very nice stitch. You do get these fabric samples. Leather. Three layers of garment leather. And I found this machine at an estate sale, and even though it didn't have the cams with it, I could not leave it. It was so beautiful. The paint was so beautiful on this machine that I just couldn't leave it. And it's such a unique machine. I've never seen this before with it, the school pens the way they are and it's just a very very neat looking machine very very nice on three layers of denim and last but not least we're going to put in a more delicate fabric not sure exactly what it is but it's kind of chintzy and we're going to loosen things up a little and you'll see that it's going to do a nice job on a delicate as well as the heavy duty
beautiful, beautiful stitch on a more delicate fabric. And that is the New Home Janome, model 671.